I was inside the building right there, looking, we just looking at it, you know, and we saw a lady screaming outside, and then the lady from this store started screaming to say, say the, the leave her alone, and then I, we saw a guy pulling a purse for the lady, and when, we, when I saw that, I just started running. I don't even see the, the traffic, the cars coming. I just try to chase the guy, try to get him. Hello. But a lot of people get involved, so he ran about three, four blocks from here when a guy from the car asked me, what's going on? And I told him, hey, the guy who's running right there with the blue jacket, he stole a purse. So he pulled him in his car, and this guy, he get him first. He got two weapons in his package. What kind of weapons? Two big uh, knives. So he could have stopped us, you know? Yeah, I mean, uh, that's one thing I think the police will generally say is, you know, don't be a hero. Were you afraid? No, I'm not afraid, you know. I just try to get the purse back from, from the lady. How was the lady? Was she okay? She was okay. She just hurt her knee a little bit, but she's okay. Were you not frightened at all? No, you know, when you see these things, when somebody's taking advantage of older people, you have to step out. That's what I did. And then you called the police, or? I was running when I called the police with uh, somebody else's cell phone and my cell phone. Uh, I hang up because I can't even speak to the lady because I was running. Yeah. And uh, I got sandals. I was not even having my tennis shoes. But at least we got it.